colored pencil shading technique is very straightforward. First, you want to lightly fill in a shape or area that you intend on shading. I am working on top of other pieces of paper because I know that my workspace is kind of scratchy and I don't want that to show through. So if you're working at home, you can work on top of a notebook or a sketchbook. I'm just lightly filling the area in and I'm keeping my marks very close together. Trying to keep fairly even pressure and get right up to the edge. To shade this area, you're going to apply more pressure. So push down a little bit harder and really take your time and trace the contour or outside edges of the shape to add more intense color. I'm gonna do that on all of my edges on this particular artwork. Depending on which artwork you're doing, the requirements of how you're shading might be different. So make sure you read the requirements for your specific assignment. After I've made the edges darker, I'm going to blend my dark edges towards the center by gradually using less pressure as I work my way back towards the center. This can be also achieved with multiple different colors and you can blend colors together. So once again, you carefully fill in an area. I like to outline it first. Fill the area in with even pressure. Make the edges slightly darker by pushing down more. This technique will also work with crayons, by the way. And then gradually taper off your pressure. So start with fairly hard pressure and then back to very light pressure. And that will blend your color together and make the transition smoother.